Hello, this is Tori with Landio. We have a new 35-acre wooded home site in Southern Colorado. This property borders more than 3,250 acres of BLM land along the entire west and south boundaries. We're going to jump right into the interactive map because you're going to want to see how this property borders more than 3,250 acres of BLM land along the entire west boundary and along the entire south boundary. And this BLM land has lots of mature trees, open meadows, varied terrain, so it's an incredibly diverse and desirable area. And it's rare to find a property that borders this amount of BLM land and is also so easily accessible. Right over here is State Highway 69. This is a paved state highway and this is County Road 541. So you're just about two miles from the paved state highway. Then to the north of the property you have the Horfano River which is going to be a magnet for wildlife. There were lots of fresh wildlife tracks and droppings on the property, which we'll show you in some of these photos. If we look at the topographic map, you can see the varied terrain on the property and all of the bordering BLM land. And this blue line here indicates a path of seasonal water flow. Here's a view from the property looking over the open valley at Greenhorn Mountain in the San Isabel National Forest right here. Now we're looking towards the southwest at Silver Mountain. Here's some of the fresh wildlife tracks and droppings on the property. There's varied terrain, lots of mature trees. Here's some aerial photos we're looking towards the east at Bedito Cone. Again this is Greenhorn Mountain in the San Isabel National Forest. And then this is looking to the northeast. This is the valley and the open meadows on the property surrounded by the varied terrain with mature trees. This is looking west along the paved state highway 69 and this is where it intersects with county road 541 so the property is only two miles from this intersection these are electricity lines and poles along county road 541 and then this is the road that takes you to the property so from this intersection right here the property is only one mile again here's more electricity lines and poles and then this is a path that takes you to the property it's through this little gate right here so if we go back to our interactive map that location where that gate was located that we saw in the photo that is right here and this is the road we saw with the electricity lines and poles which then connects directly to County Road 541 right here and then 541 to Highway 69 right here. So you have great convenient access to the property and then the paved state Highway 69 takes you directly east and intersects with Interstate 25 where you'll find the town of Walsenburg which has a population around 3200. You also have the Lathrop State Park and two lakes right here. Then Interstate 25 takes you south down to Trinidad right here which has a population around 10,000 about an hour away then interstate 25 takes you north to Pueblo which is only an hour from the property and Pueblo has a population around 110,000 so pretty much anything you need you can find in Pueblo you also have the Lake Pueblo State Park which is 4,600 surface acres where you enjoy boating fishing water sports and other types of recreational activities this is the parcel highlighted here in green on the plat map it's lot 88 and there we are zoomed in on the plat map and around the perimeter of each parcel there's a 20 foot wide easement so where there are adjoining parcels that easement is 40 feet wide so you have both physical and legal access to the property and you have amazing breathtaking views from the property this is looking at the Sangre de Cristo mountain range lots of varied terrain and mature trees this is an open meadow on the southwest portion of the property then here we have a view of Silver Mountain this is Mount Mestis and Rough Mountain more fresh wildlife tracks and droppings on the property now we're south of the property looking north here we have the paved state highway 69 this is Greenhorn Mountain in the San Isabel National forest as we zoom in closer you can see how the terrain lays so what you have is the valley at the northwest portion of the property and then surrounded by these ridges some with an elevation change of almost 200 feet which provides a lot of privacy and protection you have the ease of access of this open meadow being right at the northwest corner of the property and if you tie that in with what we saw on the interactive map with the yellow shaded area for all the BLM land this entire south boundary right here and this entire west boundary border BLM land. So if you could so if you could just imagine over 3,250 acres that extends all throughout this area. To give you an idea of how large that area of BLM land is that adjoins the property, it'd be like taking almost 93 of these parcels and putting them together. So just think how big 35 acres is and imagine 93 of those parcels together. 
So it's all public land for your enjoyment, hunting, hiking, outdoor recreation, animal watching, all available as an extension of your property. Now several of the nearby landowners have developed their properties to varying degrees, which are represented here by these white circles. Here are a couple neighbors that have what appear to be double wide manufactured or mobile homes. This one has a basement that appears to be like the full size of the home. Here are photos of some of the other neighbors. You can see that many will have accessory buildings, workshops, guest homes, sheds. Others will have barns, corrals. Some have working ranches there are no covenants or restrictions there's no hoa there's no hoa fees there's no time limit to build the minimum dwelling size is only 600 square feet from the property you're only about seven minutes to the town of gardner there's a cafe school multiple churches post office and just a few minutes from the bedito cone in the san isabel national forest you're about 30 minutes to the town of walzenberg and that entire drive is almost all paved state highway and then interstate 25. walzenberg has a population around 3200 it's the county seat of horfano county where the property is located there's a hospital in Walzenberg, the Level 4 Trauma Center, Colorado State Veterans Home, specialty medical clinics, lumber and building supply store. There are multiple grocery stores in Walzenberg. This is Main Street where you'll find shopping, dining, professional services, K-12 public school, golf course in Walzenberg. And you're about 39 minutes to the Lathrop State Park where there's two lakes where you can enjoy fishing, boating, water sports, hunting, horseback riding, camping, and other types of activities. This is a trail map for the Lathrop State Park. It's about 1,600 acres. Near about 40 minutes to La Vida, which is a popular tourist destination. Again, about an hour from Pueblo. Pueblo has a population around 110,000, where you'll also find the Lake Pueblo State Park. And Lake Pueblo is about 4,600 surface acres. Then to the south, you're about an hour from Trinidad. Trinidad has a population around 10,000. You have pretty much anything you need you can find in Trinidad. Just outside of Trinidad, you have the Trinidad Lake State Park and the 800-acre Trinidad Lake. About an hour and 35 minutes to the Great Sand Dunes National Park, which has the tallest sand dunes in all of North America. We have about an hour and 37 minutes to Colorado Springs. Colorado Springs has a population around half a million. Then you're just two hours and 45 minutes to Denver. Denver is the largest city in Colorado. Denver and the surrounding metropolitan area have a population well over a million. There's an international airport in Denver as well. We have this 35-acre wooded home site bordering more than 3,250 acres of BLM land with diverse terrain, priced at just 45000 All the property details are listed here on our website. Property taxes are only about $375 a year for the entire 35-acre parcel. There's no HOA. There are no HOA fees. There's no time limit to build. You can use the property recreationally, seasonally, or live there full-time. The minimum dwelling size is only 600 square feet. Here we have the the distances to nearby points of interest along with links where you find more information about those locations. We have the GPS coordinates with links where you can view the GPS coordinates on a Google map. We have over 160 photos of the property and surrounding area in this interactive map. If this property fits what you're looking for, we highly recommend you go to our website and click on this buy now button. What that'll do is add a deposit of $499 to your cart, then click checkout. Once you click checkout, this window will appear where you can enter in all your information and continue through the checkout process. Once the checkout process has been completed, we'll receive an instant notification that your $499 deposit has been made. Immediately, this buy now button will change to out of stock. There's only one person that can place a deposit on this property. We sell our properties on a first come first serve basis. So if this property does fit what you're looking for, we highly recommend that you place a deposit to secure the property before it's sold. Your $499 deposit is credited towards your purchase and then we cover all of the closing costs. The remaining balance may be paid by wire transfer, cashier's check, ACH bank draft, credit card, debit card, or any combination of these methods. We make the whole process super simple and it can be completed in as little as a day. If you have any questions, our phone number is on the top of every page of our website. That number is 713-597-7670. That number also receives text messages. We also have this live chat feature here on our website where you can communicate with us in real time. If we're not available for whatever reason, please send us a message or respond to your next availability. We also have this contact form here on our website that you can fill out, or you can send us an email directly. Our email address is hello at landio.com. As always, we really appreciate you taking the time to watch our videos and share our properties and our website with all your family, friends, and colleagues. May God continue to bless you and your family with health, peace, and prosperity.